Jenny Staten here for IrishBoxing.com with Stephen Armand. Stephen, Terry Flanagan fight just reconfirmed today. Yeah, it's just announced. We knew we there now, Monday, Monday gone, that it's going to be announced. So it's only for February 14th. And, uh, no way. I'm back at it now. Just last year was seen to be gone frustrating, but you had some at the end of it. Was it what was it like when you, you had to pull out? I had to pull out because I was injured, you know. Hold on! <laughs> but uh, I had to pull out because uh, I got sick. Mm. Big fight, you know. But, do you know, it worked out better now because the trains over here last last week, you know, and these things happen. But uh, it's just great at the start of the year, getting the date so it's so soon. We prefer that way. Six yeah. weeks, we need to go around, you know. From straight to training camp. First day, yes, see. Monday. I mean, uh, and uh, straight to square. But you're the, you're the everyday in the gym, bloke. Yeah. So was that. Three weeks off or three four weeks, weeks off, you do the world of good. Uh, three weeks, weeks off has been great, you know. Yeah. It's been brilliant to me. I feel great now. I'm hungry for it. Man's been there. I can't wait for it for this week. And uh, just on you before, you about Flanagan, you, you, you have general respect for them, like yeah, as a fighter. Respect, and, yeah. Um, yeah. It's, it's in my way. They get him in my way. That's what I want to do, you know. I'm not aware of it, but I just want to get him in my way. And after all the years, you're basically now one fight away, one good performance away from a world title shot. One fight away now, so it's, it's, it's a big fight for me, but I'm just going to get in there and enjoy it, enjoy it. I'm fought in ages, you know, I just want to get in there and now fight, so I just can't wait for the state. I'm just itching for it and play the rumble, you know. Um, the what about the venue and all? It seems an hour of the way played. Where is it? Bir Birmingham? Uh, Wolves. Oh, Wolves. Wolverhampton, yeah. So I don't care if it's in the back here, I don't care where it is. Put it out there in the out there in the car park, you know. That's what I feel at the moment. That's what I'm fighting. And have you thought of yourself to look beyond? Have you thought who you could be fighting for? If you beat him for? I'm not going to look, look past me. Yeah. I know, I know what I can do. Just to, on the night, you know what I mean. Fe February 14th is my night. And I've got to perform, you know, do the business. But I'm not going to look past him. I know it's big things there. Sure. Every fight is the last fight, you know what I mean? So yeah. I'm just going to focus on the uh, 14th of February and then we go up there. And you're 31 now, is it? Yeah. yeah like, but right now, it's just it. Like, is, it, is it now or never? Now or never. I'm always saying that, but it, it is. Yeah. Every fight is the last fight, you know what? I still, I still, I feel of lots, lots of going, you know, lots of gain. I haven't got many fights. Yeah, so with all the delays and all that stuff, you know, and then. Um, so I was going to take for it, man. Do you reckon you, you're at your peak at 31, where a lot of people might peak around 27, 28? Because of the I don't know, because I go with fights. Yeah. We only have like, what, 18, 18 fights. Yeah. You know, my age, like, people have fights many, you know. Yeah. I go with that, and I'm always training, so that's a good thing, you know. So listen, we see what happens. Every fight is happening. It's, uh, it's the main fight now at the moment, and we go with it. And in terms of... Like it being delayed and all, the gym is buzzing now at the minute after John O and probably Luke getting prize fighter. Does that give you, it's easier to train in that atmosphere or does that help yeah, in any way? Training here, well, there's only owner training anyway, yeah, but it's very, yeah. with all the lads, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's a bit of crack in the gym, Pass has been a great coach. He's passing his ring every day, he's watching, he's watching things, he studies all the fighters, you know, yeah. he's studying and stuff like that. He's a great coach, great coach to have with you, you know, so, and the lads, they spared, and so, so much more spared. Has Pass has given you any advice on Flanagan of yet, I presume, because yeah, you were close with the things, last one? Yeah, we're working on things for the last one, from that camp, we're trying to camp, I'm going to pull up to this one now, to start, start fresh again, you know. And uh, Pass, we don't watch any fighters, yeah. very rare, because we just watch it for a minute and then that's it, I think I'll watch it once. But yeah, yeah. It's not a focus on him, but he's not a focus on what he's going to do, you know. The pass was held to me and I just do it in the ring. And what about with Andy winning the WBO title and this being an eliminator? Is there a hope that if he does defend in Ireland, you could get That'd be great, wouldn't it? the shot here? Yeah. I, just, I, need, I would love to have a fight here. I never want to have a fight here as well. It's, that's the main thing I'm going to focus on. I have to ask him, delighted for Andy Lee, you know, well, well done to him, like, brilliant. I couldn't be more happy for a guy to win that, you know, for Andy, he's there. You, were you in Irish camps for Andy? Yeah, I, mean, yeah. I know Andy from being in New York, and yeah. a friend, you know, he's a gentleman, you know, he's so delighted for him. Is that one fight you watched? I know you don't watch most boxers, did you watch no, that? No, no, we actually yeah. watch that, I don't watch boxers. Yeah. We actually delighted for him when he watched that, you know. I watch it for him. No, I was delighted for him, and then uh, pray for him. He deserves it. Yeah. So, yeah, let's see what happens after for all everybody else, you know, it's, it's going to help all the other for us, you know. Including yourself. Yeah. Thanks for that, Mr. Thanks, George. Appreciate it, no brother.